Hi guys, how are you all? Um, again, if you've seen or it's in uh, preparing uh, mom and dad's dinner, uh, the eggplant uh, salad with alongside with uh, some uh, good uh, treats for, for my tita's uh, deli or Chinese deli shop. It's called Take a Bow. Take your bow. Take your bow. Um, I will be putting the description down below and also in the comment section and then also I used uh, that's her line of Asian food no I, I had Chopao I had her good um, bean soup she had a good line of products they just uh, also I want to um, share this to you guys it's called Kalamanzing concentrate uh, it is a calamansi based product that is versatile good for the sweet and savory prepar food preparations so again of course we know it, it can be um, mixed with a uh, uh, simple as water hot or cold it's either a tea or a cold beverage or you can also use this for your um, cocktail mixes or mocktail mixes there's no alcohol when you use, when you say mock mocktail and also well, you can use this also um, in making or as a base for some uh, like um, pastry or baking um, applications there are because uh, we will need some citrus flavorings um, it heightens or how do you call this heightens a taste or a palate when you add the palate when you add any citrus item although kalamanzing is a, has a distinct flavor that's why it's called we call it the amazing powerful fruit with its real juice and pulp uh, we have extracted um, this the the our kalamansi our very own philippine lime aside from dayap but also this one kalamansi the kalamansi product so again if you're interested please do um uh, check out the details down below or in the comment section and also wait i'm going i'm going to get other product okay okay so this one guys is actually uh i'm you know i'm discuss it very raw in my blog because that's uh, how this product started with my with the family of course uh, we do all have our different versions because i have uh, also we have relatives also who sells bagoong at emily's uh, some of my aunts also i don't know already but uh, somehow if you want this uh, version please try ours uh, my uh, cousin, um, at Emily, she sells um, sweet, the sweet type. It's good also. I tasted it. I don't know my other aunts uh, if they are still selling. This complemented with the um, fried eggplant. Please watch that video because I also um, at least shared how we can prepare or fry eggplants without much oil. Although we used a little, we seasoned it, but how... I did how mom shared to me to lessen the grease when you eat uh, fried eggplant, sorry, excuse me for. And then, so this one uh, is the uh, special uh, sweet uh, style sauteed shrimp paste or sweet bagoong. Uh, in Tagalog, we call it here in the Philippines. It's a shrimp paste. So again, um, this is uh, actually dedicated to my lola or uh, grandmother who is named Patring and uh, my late grandmother so uh, it's going to be called Patring's spices herbs and condiments so it's going to be here I'll put it here so guys um, please mom says her favorite color was fuchsia so spell fuchsia guys <laughs> anyway since we are coming up with some line still um, this is just the sweet version and we're gonna have more so again and so much more um there's also kalamanzing juice uh, i will be sharing more so please visit uh my uh, aunt's uh, facebook or green mills and rainforest for your uh, special locations uh, celebrations uh, you may book uh, through their facebook um it's called uh, green mills and rainforest uh, and then it's, it's located in Scout Brumeo of Quezon City. 
uh, in Timog. Um, Baker Bao is a takeout of dim sum and special Filipino specialties um, like uh, you know the Shoma along Esteban Abada. It's just along Esteban Abada. That stretch. All right. Thank you so much. Of course, uh, please visit uh, my cousin's website, uh, jeffalbea.com. Uh, I need not say more. Uh, Jeff, Jeff uh, I've not seen you so long for a long time. Um, you know already what I mean. Uh, anyways, guys, if you need sculptures, um, gowns, uh, a signature um, work of art, the family of the Albeas also they do um, artworks and uh, a line of uh, gowns uh, in, in the fashion industry um, yeah take care, thanks to watch um, Fine TV Hobby Homeschool if you are, you know, bored or never ever interested in doing chores at home or tasks, you will call it because you are you feel like you're obliged but imagine guys if you enjoy the task then it's not already a chore it's not a task it's not an assignment it's not a homework but it, it's a rather a what a hobby already because you enjoy it i have learned to do that already but i'm hum homebody so uh yeah so i learned to like it already aside from cooking but honestly i always tell you um i have learned to like choring or doing um, things at home because I had nothing to do. I'm free. So what else to do, right? So as well, of course, we all we all know how to clean, how to, um, you know, clear things up, but not as tedious as, you know, as uh, skeptical, as uh, detailed as this is lately in my videos i'm not saying that i am you know i'm the guru of the i don't know um never not at all but i have to right we as i don't know there's something about it in cleaning don't you think so guys there's something about it um it feels right it feels light after you have done cleaning up uh, uh folding things scrubbing uh, off uh, some you know dried up whatever dirt on the <laughs> even you guys also when you had your when you have your car washed right even if you did not car wash it somebody has and you just wash it it's so i, I don't know it, for me it's so uh satisfying <laughs> you are you uh, are we on the same page <laughs> anyway so guys again thank you thank you so much i've, I've been keeping you too long here okay guys huh? this one kalaman zing Thank you for all uh, my loved ones, my relatives. Uh, I I wish I, you know, I I would have said this earlier. But anyway, I uh, just missing you all, all of you. Uh, well, not uh, no one that I am. I have forgotten uh, remembering you all from afar. Thanks, guys. Thanks, thanks. Uh, if you uh, tried uh, visiting my channel, if not, uh, my anonymity is uh, um, is my choice. I I needed to. Uh, thanks for understanding. If not, how do I make it up? <laughs> All right. Um, I would be assuming if I say my anonymity, please cancel that. Uh, my not showing up <laughs> that I meant po um, anyways yeah